What's the ladies and the greats, everybody? My name is jblaze 34 and welcome to the final match of the DBL. We are in the championship, and we're going up against Sharp Dress Gaming, coach of the Minnesota Wild Chargers. Uh, he has a dangerous team. He has some bulk to it. Uh, GLHF. Um, yeah, but we have our Talent Flame, Heat Next, Booker T, Hug Me, Trish, Sangetsu, Thunderclap. You know, our standard, what we bring. Uh, he has his Mega Gardevoir, Mammal Swine. I think he might want to lead off with that Mammal Swine. I think Mammal Swine will come out. Uh, whatever it is, Zangetsu will be our best bet to go into. Starts off with our model. This is great. I could Scald. Or I could U-Turn. I could U-Turn. It won't do too much damage. Uh, he will bring out... He doesn't have a Spin Blocker. That's good. Let's U-Turn out. Uh, he's gonna he's gonna does he want to do damage to me do I risk him because looking at his team Zongetsu will put in massive work well Thunderclap also has a uh, grass knot we're holding a salt vest so I think we will be good on that part uh, let's go for a scald I want to get rid of this guy super effective no burn he just gets his rock up uh, that is great we could go for another or should I go for a grass knot? I could go for a grass knot here. Let's go for a grass knot. See if he wants to preserve him. There's my loaded grass knot predictions. Grass type. Oh, that does 55%. Oh, he has a citrus berry. I could go for another grass knot. If he wants to stay in, he could stay in. I could go for another grass knot. Um, or I could switch out into thunderclap here. And preserve. Hmm. I'm gonna U-turn now. I'm gonna preserve the focus sash. We get a crit. Ooh. Uh, we're gonna go out into thundercloud. We're gonna take rock damage, but we have the soul vest, so sh we should be able to do um, live uh, whatever. Yeah. Don't get the burn. No burn. Okay. Now let me let me do some calculations here. Uh, this is the championship. Let's see, thunderous T. We'll say we are choice guard. We are not modest. We are a timid nature. We have grass knot on our guy here. We'll say Milotic. Say so you defensive. Let's see. Would a grass knot take him out? A grass knot does 49 to 58%. Uh, we'll say. What about if he is all special defensive? So we'll take all this up. We'll type in 2 for 2. A uh, grass knot. Still looks like it kales here. What if he is a careful nature? Where's possible scenario? Grass knot does 44% is the best, 37% is the lowest. So it's a roll here. I'm going for a grass knot. Predicting there's our model. Alright, so down goes our model. Did we take anything? No. There's Mammal Swine. He's gonna want to go for that ice shard. I'm going out right out into Booker T. We're gonna get rid of these rocks. This is the perfect switch in. The perfect switch in. Here, here's the ice shard. Oh, earthquake! Ah, well that does nothing. Let's go for an R spin. There's Celebi. That's fine. So I gotta preserve this Booker T now. Uh, I don't want to take anything. We're gonna go out into our uh, Ferrothorn here. We're gonna set up rocks of our own. We're gonna make sure he takes damage. Anything Sash is gonna go down. There's Giga Drain resisted. Okay, we're doing great so far. Uh, hmm, should I Leech Seed? No, I think Rocks would be our best bet here. We're gonna go for Rocks. There we go. Now let's go for a knockoff. We lived, we lived. There's the knockoff, super effective. We got rid of his leftovers. Okay, so he changed up his moveset. Is Ferrothor needed for anything on his team? I'm betting that Gardevoir has HP fire. We got our rocks up. We got rid of his rocks. Uh, we could... Celebi is base 101. Uh, base 100. So our Thunderous actually outspeeds. We could go into Zangetsu. Let's see. We go into our Greninja. We'll go Greninja. Mix Attacker. Say 100 and we'll say Celebi, he looks like a nasty plot with two attacks. We are not life for, we'll put leftovers and hmm. Say so U turn. U turn. Modest. Well, I'm gonna go for a uh, 
knock off here. Goes for a Giga Drain, switches out. He probably predicted the water type. I could have protected. Uh, Greninja U turn looks to be a. It does not knock him out. It would not knock him out. I mean, I could go on to Trish and we could just wreck shop here. We could take care of business. I have Fire Punch on her. So we're going to go on to Trish. We're going to get our Mega Evolution off and we're going to go for that fake out. Let's go for that fake out. Ooh. There's the fake out. 21%. Uh, C. Lopany. Mega Lopany. All out attacker. And we have Fire Punch. Fire Punch looks to be a. Oof. Ooh, it does not take him out. It does not take him out. A return does not take him out either. Hmm. So he showed Giga Drain. Hidden power. Do I risk it? Let's do it. I don't think he was bold nature. We take him out. Sweet. Okay, I risked it. I risked it, but it's okay. It worked out. It worked out perfectly. There's Conkelder. Conkelder. We're going to go right out into Booker T. We're going to go right out into Booker T. Get the intimidation off. We have fake out. We go for the aerial ace. We can do whatever we want here. There's a drain punch. Does nothing. Does nothing. Okay, now here, I can go for an aerial ace. I can go for a close combat. I think aerial ace would be the best bet. Uh, or I could switch out. I'm staying in. I'm going to go for an aerial ace. 77%. There's a knockoff. Does nothing to us. I'm going to go for another aerial ace. Get as much damage as we can on him. He's gonna keep going for drain punches. That's fine. So we do 21%. That drain punch does 24. So we go for another one. And you know what? I think we probably we might have this match in the bag. Uh, Heatnix could come in. See, so he has drain punch knockoff. Uh, let's see. Conkelder. We'll say a standard OU set. Mega Law Pony, ah, uh, we do not have high jump kick. We have drain punch instead of high jump kick. So drain punch, fake out will do 26, return will do 66%. So we'll go out into Trish. We will fake out. So there is Gardevoir, takes the fake out. And now I just go for a return. Honestly, just go for a return. Go for the return. So fake out return. He's seen fire punch. He hasn't seen our final move. Hmm. Now with Talonflame in the back. Remember we always bring Talonflame. To be our late game sweeper. And it seems that it's going to come down to that. It does seem like it's going to come down to Talonflame being our late game sweeper. And he's probably going to get us this championship. Ooh. I prepared for that Scizor. Because priority bullet punch is nothing to mess with. There's Conkelder. Now if he's assault vest, let's see, if he has no vestment in special defense, say we put everything in defense, would he live a return? He has a chance to live a return. I could go on to Thunderclap. We're gonna go. We can go on to Thunderclap. Sack him off. Go for the fake out. There's a Mog Punch. We resist it. Okay. That did 19%. So now I'm just gonna go for a. Uh, we're gonna go for knockoff. We're just sacking off. I could go on Heat Nix here. I mean, Trish does take it. And Zangetsu's in the back with, uh, with a Focus Sash. So we're going to go on to Heat Nix, and we are just going to Bray Bird everything. Bray Bird. Down goes Moses. Alright. We can take out the Gardevoir too. There's Mammal Swine. It does not have a seat. Talonflame. He is adamant, right? 
You are adamant, right? You are. Okay, cool. You're adamant. We'll say Mamo. Sash lead. Bray Bird. Let's still knock him out from here. It doesn't. We got the low roll. We got the lowest roll. Wow, we got the lowest roll. Oh my gosh, we got the lowest roll possible from this thing. Wow, I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that. We got the low roll. It says right here, Brave Bird would do 78% to 92%. And he did 78%. So he, okay, I don't understand this one. We're going to go for a return. Mega Evolution. There's a return. It's going to take out his Gardevoir. I would have figured he would have probably stayed in. And down goes his Mammal Swine to the rocks. Um, I don't understand that move. But you know what? It is what it is. GG. And wow, we are champions. We are the champions. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we are the DBL, the Delta Battle Leagues Season 2 Champions. This is our first season with the DBL and this this is great. This is awesome. I wasn't sure we we're going to pull it off. To be honest, uh, Sharp Dress Gaming does have one of the most terrifying teams in uh in the whole in the whole league with Scizor, Mega Gardevoir, Mammal Swine. I mean, you just saw that. Conkelder, Mammal Swine, uh Scizor, he has our model Milotic uh, he also has Who else does he have? He has another Pokemon another he has Magnazone as well This guy just had a stacked team a really stacked team, and I'm very surprised that we came out on top uh, It just this is just a fantastic feeling if you guys enjoyed this battle hit that like button and if you are proud to see Jay Blitz as the season 2 DBL champion subscribe hit the like button share it to all of the above because this is a fantastic feeling and thank you so much for watching i hope you have a great day catch you later bye bye